Hey guys, this is VRay91, and I'm talking about The Witcher 3 on Switch. Now, for those of you who don't know, The Witcher 3 was announced for Nintendo Switch at Nintendo's E3 Direct, right? And like I said, if this game can be ported over Switch, basically any game, in my opinion, can be ported over Switch. But how does it run on Switch? I mean, The Witcher 3 is a graphically high game, and Switch, compared to the other ones, is very limited hardware. Well, we got the numbers, and it's going to be 540p in handheld mode, and 720p in docked mode. Now, that's far down from most Switch games. Most Switch games are 1080p in docked mode, I believe, and then 720p in handheld mode. But, hey, you gotta downgrade the graphics because this is a really graphically high game. But that's not all I want to talk about here because there is some good news, and that is that once you buy that game cartridge, if you buy it physically, obviously, you will have to download nothing. And I mean nothing. That is The Witcher 3 with all the DLC and all of it fits on the cartridge. One 32 gigabyte cartridge. So if this game, a game that massive and a game that graphically high can be poured over the Switch with no downloads required if you buy the physical version, then almost any game can be ported over the Switch with no downloads required in my opinion because Witcher 3 of most games, I wouldn't think The Witcher 3 would not need a download. That is just amazing in my opinion that they actually decided to go for one 32 gigabyte card. And other companies out there, follow the example please. Because, because as a switch over myself, I could tell you that I don't want to download anything once I buy the cartridge. I'd rather just plug the cartridge in and play. It is so much easier than having to download anything. So I really approve of this. Even though I'm not a fan of The Witcher myself and I don't plan on getting Witcher 3. I think that other companies need to follow the example and definitely need to get their full games on those cartridges. We don't need to have those day one downloads or anything like that in my opinion. If The Witcher 3 can do it, then almost any game can do it. But anyway, what do you guys think about this and what do you guys think about The Witcher 3 graphic wise and then being able to fit the whole game and all the DLC on one 32 gigabyte cartridge? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, remember to like, share, and subscribe and may God bless you all.